<laughs> oh my god, I have a mental and physical problem. But yes, guys, um, the slob is back after his three-day break. It really wasn't a break. I just had technical difficulties, and I had to buy a new t a new camera, eight by six. So it's pretty good. You know, the shitty um fuzzy ass background that we all love in depth. That vote on Instagram, you want me to buy that $300 camera. And I will! Soon! Soon, you probably think like 12 years. Well, you're wrong. But, um, I got a new pop, but we're not gonna go over that. That'll be tomorrow's video, which will be a fashion pop for you. Okay, yeah. But we're gonna go over, um, since our last video did so well, the TargetCon video. We're going to come back to it and go over everything you need to know and which ones will be popular. Almost like a wrap-up and like what time it should be there. They added some, so let's get right into it. So they added some new ones to this list. Pretty cool. There is a 10-inch plushine. Yeah, it, it would like, I think, ice cream. I, I forget how the plushine looks. I'll put a picture of the pops on the screen that are coming to the Target Con. Um, I'll also put up the list of the stuff of the DPCI. Well, I don't know the DPCI for that, but um, yeah. So my guess is will it sell out? Most likely not. I mean, there really isn't that much Plushine fans out there. I mean, don't get me wrong. My sisters love Plushine, but so I. I I gave away my pushing pops to them. I didn't have no, because I didn't have no spots to put them. But yeah, um, I mean, it's it's just a it's just a blow up size pop, so I don't know. But then number two, we have ten inch Kool Aid Man, and you're probably wondering, well, where's the official glam? Right up there. It was actually leaked. Targets are getting it in, so. This is actually a legit date. They're not going to screw it up like how they did last time. The 19th when that Muhammad Ali was supposed to come out. Then got changed to the 5 of January. So I think it's official. Um, but we still haven't got... Oh, I won't go over that. Those are coming up. Um, but um, yes. So will that sell out? Probably. So... I think my dad or me, I don't know if I'm taking school off Friday or something, or coming in late. Because, um, I don't know, but the, uh, there's a Target in Connecticut, if you're wondering, and I don't know. A lot of the collectors are going to go there to, um, like, try to get the stuff. Try to get their wants. So, my my plan is just get there at 6 and wait for it to open at 8, but I don't know. But that pop will sell out. I'm get I'm calling it cause it's awesome. Everybody loves the Kool-Aid man. <laughs> oh yeah. That was cringy. Please no one clip that. Please no one clip that meme. But um yeah, oh who cares? No one's no one's gonna do that. My fans don't love me. And they probably will never will. Okay. But yeah, um anyway. Hey, I'm filming. I'm filming. Can I show you something? I'm filming. Can I show you something? No, I'm filming. Sorry. Okay. So, yeah. Um, then we have 10 inch the thing. That one will sell out. That one, well, I don't know. I mean, it's a cool pose, but um, it's just blown up. I mean, I'm going to probably get that with my mom. Um, I don't know. I'll think about it. But then the 10 inch Michael Jordan, that will sell out because it's actually a different pose. I think it's a pose of him like up in the air with the basketball like that, like that one. That's pretty dope. That's a pretty good one. Um, that's gonna sell out of course. I'm not gonna get it though. Do we have the plushie with cupcake? So that one I actually do not have a picture of how it looks, but um yes actually I do. Um right up there. But yeah um that is just like super cool. Like that's amazing looking. I'm the plushie I uh, the plushie with cup Cake is just, I mean, it's a kiddish style. I don't know. I'm not gonna get it. But um, now we have the Mando of Flames, which is the Mandalorian. That is amazing. I will get that. That that will sell out. So if you're going, 
If you're gonna be like one of those target campers who camp out, that's gonna be the number one pop probably on everybody's list. And you better, and if you're not getting that pop when you're there, I don't know what you're, I don't know what you're doing in your life, cause you gotta get that man. That is a good ass pop. Okay. Then we have the path, the Pathfinder. And yes, that's probably gonna sell out the Mandalorian. But the Pathfinder, eh, uh, Apex Legends. Oh, that's nasty. Moving on. Sorry, sorry for the hate. Okay, then we have Doc Holiday. My dad likes Doc Holiday. I don't know if he'll get it. I don't know. But, um, yeah, he's cool. He has a, I think he has a double guns. Or he has, like, or he's in, like, some style, I think. I don't know. But then we have the Chester Cheetah Collector's Box. Now, on the image, the Target one, it has, um, like, shirt. So, I don't know if it's just a T set. I hope it's a pop. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna get that. And there's a Garfield collector's box, flocked. That's probably gonna be cool. I mean, I hate to see like when you're like, oh my god, I ho I can't wait to make the flock version. I can't wait to see the flocked version. Now I don't have to buy the common. Wait, where is it? It's August. Where, where the hell are they? In February 2020, up oh, there it is. Funko milking again. What I'm trying to say. Then we had like a bunch of Funko Verse games and like strategy games, all that unknown T stuff. I don't know, but then there's like that um, there's like that C3PO with like the designs on it. I think I don't know. I honestly do not know. But that is a wrap up of Target Con. The number three thing that you should be going after is the 10 inch Michael Jordan, the 10 inch Kool Aid Man. And the Mandalorian with flames. Wait. Oh, and the Chester Cheetah box, maybe. But yeah. I can't take it no more. Actually, I, I can't. I haven't gave up. But New York Toy Fair starts this Friday, so. Yeah.